Hello and welcome to the video. This is a very quick video for this gentleman here. This is Mansky 209 and he was asking, is there a way to set up a button to act as an arm or disarm switch so you can't accidentally hit the throttle and have your vehicle take off on you? And the cool thing is, is that that is really easy to do. This is HTX and that kind of capability has been around and shown in lots of other videos for many, many years, but not necessarily on the MT-12. So Mansky 209, this one, is for you. Now by default the throttle which is the trigger is going to appear on the first channel. You can see it moving here as I accelerate the value goes up it goes to the middle channel value when it's in the default position and as a reverse it goes in the opposite position. So how would we make it so that one of these switches would act as a throttle safety or a throttle cut? That's really easy. What we're going to do we're going to click model and then what we're going to do is we're going to page all the way across till we get to something called special functions. And special functions allows us to manipulate how the radio performs using controls. So we'll hit enter and what we'll do is we will move a switch into a particular position. I would recommend, I would use something like this switch here. This is switch A. I'm gonna put it in the default position as the radio turns on and then we're going to select override channel one. Channel one again is the throttle channel and we're gonna set the value as zero. That's the middle channel position, which is the one you want if you're not going forwards or backwards. You can set that to any value that you want. However, we want it to basically lock onto zero. We need to hit enter so that that last check box is clicked. If I come all the way out of here now, then no matter what I do to the throttle, channel one doesn't move until I move switch A out of that position and then the throttle is active. Now I would personally always use a switch that's in the default position as the radio powers up. That means that as you turn on the radio, you can't accidentally catch it. It's by default nice and safe. So that's how easy it is to do. It's really simple and straightforward. The trick is to set up some switch or control that you want to use as your throttle safety switch to in special functions override whatever output you've got set for your throttle to zero. Thank you for watching the video. If you watch my videos and find them useful, then please take a moment to hit the like and subscribe button. It helps the channel a lot. If you really like what I'm doing here, you can become a Patreon and support the time I spend helping others and get access to lots of exclusive benefits. Link is in the video description. Remember that all the videos on the channel are organized into playlists, so you can easily use those playlists to find all the videos on a subject that you are interested in. Add Painless360 to your searches on Google and YouTube, and it'll help you find my content for any particular topic. Thanks again for watching, and as always, happy flying.